Hi everyone, hope you're doing good and having a great week. To all my returning subscribers, thank you for your support. And to all our viewers and those recently subscribed, thank you and welcome to the channel. So I was recently at a local coin store here in Singapore. It's one that I never visited before. This is Clifford Numismatic and Collectible Center located at Peninsula Plaza. I'll tell you a little bit more about this coin store a little later in the video. But for this video, I wanted to share with you something that I found in a junk bin located at the store. And it's this love token over here. Now what's interesting about this token is that it's from Australia. I don't believe it's that valuable. But uh, other than what's uh, written on it, I know very little about this token. And I thought by showing it on video, uh, there might be somebody out there who can share uh, more information about it. But before we get into this, uh, please leave me a like if you enjoy this sort of content. And don't forget to share and subscribe. So, let's get into it. Well, let's start with what we can learn by reading what's written on the cardboard flip. Right on top, the word Australia is written. And by looking at the token, uh, we can tell that this uh, token here came from Australia. This is a medal, and that's the year 1999 uh, written over here. Although I don't believe that this is the year when this token was minted. Right below here is written a love token. Here's a closer look at the token. Here on the office, we can see along the border the words Sovereign Hill, Ballarat, Australia. Now Sovereign Hill used to be a gold mining town. It's currently a tourist attraction. So we can tell from that that this token here represents the gold mining industry in Sovereign Hill. In the emission center, we can see two gold miners. One of them is sitting down. It appears that he's panning for gold in the waters or the river. While the other one is, uh, it looks like he's celebrating probably because they found some gold. Right here on the reverse, uh, we can see this love message which has been engraved. So from that, we can deduce that this token was sold as a blank on the reverse and it's probably sold as souvenirs to tourists who visited Sovereign Hill. Uh, just below that, we can see the date when the message was engraved, the 20th of June 1999. So from that, uh, we know that this token was not minted in 1999. Uh, just below that, we have a serial number Although I have yet to find any information regarding uh, the significance of this uh, serial number. Now I've measured and weighed this token so I can tell you its specifications. This token has a weight of 20.7 grams, a diameter of 31.8 mm, and a thickness of 3.59 mm with a smooth edge. From what little information that I could find on the internet, I believe these tokens were emitted in brass and are probably gold plated although that's just a guess. I also think that these tokens were sold by the Soho Foundry located at Sovereign Hill. A Soho Foundry uh, used to be a brass smithing company, although it's now a tourist attraction. And you can find uh, many of their souvenirs uh, still being sold on the secondary market. All right, uh, so here's the token safely in a capsule. As I mentioned uh, briefly in the beginning, I found this token in a junk bin at the Clifford Coin Store. They only wanted a few dollars for it, so it wasn't that expensive, but I thought it would make an interesting topic for a video, especially with the uh, love message that was uh, written behind. If uh, any of you out there uh, know more information about this token, uh, do share that uh, below with all of us here. It's quite a pretty token, and I thought it would make a nicer addition to my uh, token collection. So this coin store that I just visited, Clifford Numismatic and Collectible Center is located on the second floor of Peninsula Plaza. Uh, this plaza is right next to the Adelphi Lifestyle Mall where the Monitorum Company is located. I'll leave the link uh, to their website uh, right below. So if you are here in Singapore and you'd like to visit uh, Clifford, make sure you check out their operating hours uh, before you head on down there. They do have a wide selection of banknotes and coins on display. Many of those coins have been graded by PCGS and NGC and many of those graded coins are actually in really high grades. I did manage to speak for a while to the owner, Mr. Lam, and I told him that I have a YouTube channel and I asked him if it's okay on my next visit if I do a quick video about his coin store. He said that was okay. So when I do make my way down there again, do look out for the next coin store video which will be on the Clifford Numismatic Collectible Center. Alright, with that, I guess that will do it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. 
Hope you all enjoyed uh, taking a look at this token which I scored from the Clifford Numismatic Collectible Center. If you do have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Otherwise, uh, don't forget to leave me a like if you have enjoyed this content and be sure to hit that share and subscribe buttons down here if you have not done so. As always, uh, from all my friends here, you all please take care, be safe and have a nice day.